So while all of you were busy grilling marshmallows and hot dogs and lighting mannequins on fire, we jumped on the bandwagon and decided to violate our terms and conditions in a little bit of a different way. Sorry, Elon. Instead of trying to light stuff on fire, we disassembled the Not A Flamethrower, and on this episode of Gadget Guts, we're gonna show you how to fix it when it breaks. The Boring Company Not A Flamethrower is essentially a propane torch with an airsoft gun body, and as we take it apart, you'll see the inside of the torch like this, plus a fancy shell. This is the fuel bracket that holds the propane tank. The tank is connected to the regulator, which is held in place by some hefty screws. From there, you can separate the body by removing even more hefty screws. And then you can see the torch that's glued into place. So when it comes to repairing this thing, it's pretty modular and you can get almost every part online from the torch to the regulator and even the fancy shell. Now a real flamethrower spits out way more fuel at a higher pressure to create a longer directed flame, but a boring flamethrower works a little differently. Check it out. Before the nozzle, there's an ignition switch that lights a small pilot flame. Then holding the trigger down allows the propane to flow through the nozzle where it gets ignited by the pilot light and shoots out a badass flame. But if you're pressing the ignition switch and there's still no idle flame, check to be sure that the idle valve is open and make sure that the regulator knob is turned on. Now, if you smell excessive propane, you might have a leak in your line. Take some soapy water and apply it to the hose at the regulator. Turn on the gas and if bubbles appear, you've got a leak and need a new hose. If there's still no flame, turn the regulator off to stop the flow of gas. You might just need a new bottle of propane. And that's how you can fix your not a flamethrower. To see what we're fixing next, subscribe to our channel and follow us on social at iFixit. See you next time.